Nick, you doing? Cool King checking in again. I hope you're fine and dandy. Um, Kickstarter, let's talk about Kickstarter. Massive advocate of Kickstarter. I'm almost at 150 um, things that I've backed. Uh, some good, some bad. Uh, sometimes you, you back things and they take eight, nine months to uh, arrive and when you get them you think, I don't actually have a need for this, but it's fun to be part of the uh, the process. Um, I've not really had anything that has um, sort of bit me in the bum, shall we say. Uh, there's one or two things that I'm still waiting for that I might be waiting for some time. Uh, but that's the, the the sort of thing, you know, the beauty of Kickstarter. Uh, there's lots of people that moan and sort of bash it, but I, I genuinely believe in it. It's really good. Uh, sometimes you meet really good people um, like Lever Gear, um, who are a very good company, very innovative in what they're, they're designing and making. Um, the Lever Gear, we obviously contacted them for our 10,000 followers giveaway on Instagram and um you know the, the support they gave us through that was amazing uh, so it was good to actually have already backed uh, this item before the giveaway before we contacted them uh, this is the cable kit um, we'll go through exactly what that is uh, when I move the camera so uh, without further ado let's have a look all right so this is uh, the cable kit from lever gear as it arrives in a nice little cardboard box um, similar sort of box to what a Swiss Army knife uh, would come into uh, your Pioneer Aoxes. Let's uh, lock it open, slide it out and there you go. That's what the, the actual cable kit looks like. It's got the little lever logo there, little pocket clip as you can see just there. Um, it'll come clear as to what it is shortly. You might have an inkling now can see a USB sort of A thing there. If we pull this, I say it is easy to do. Um, I'm just being silly. If we press that and pull it at the same time, press the back there, pull that, I'm saying. There we go. Comes loose. And you can see that that is a proper USB A. And on this end, we have a lightning cable. So there you go. Yes, it is a charging cable, uh, small, flexible charging cable, but wait, it's not just a lightning cable, we also have a USB-C um, adapter there, so now we have a USB-C, USB-A to USB-C charging cable, uh, handy to have, but I'm sure the eagle-eyed people amongst you, you can see that there is also Another little tool there, you can just see sticking out there. So if we push it through there, we can uh, I will get it out. I'm struggling. But it'll come. Well, I'm gonna leave it there anyway, but there is a um sim card tool there we go i've got it sim card tool uh nice little um hidey hole for it there good idea to have i'd keep one of these in my wallet anyway uh, so to have something like this um where it would store it properly is a good idea i like it um this little tray that you can see here uh also look you know as a bonus you can fit uh, a couple of micro SD cards um, or SIM cards, the mini SIM cards in there as well. Um, so you've always got sort of backups. I like to have backup memory cards with me. It is good to have uh, them in there. So it's a handy little doodad to have this. Obviously, it's got a keyring loop at the end just there. Um, so you can hang it from something and always have it with you uh, in today's sort of society. You know we're tech savvy and uh, we've always got our phones in our hands and they're always running out of battery so you need to be able to charge it on the go uh, usb a is sort of everywhere so we can charge off computers at work or sockets now have them on you know they're everywhere so the good thing about having something like this because the um thickness and the length of the cable is 
uh, quite short and narrow. Potentially, it's going to be a quick charge as opposed to the um, the standard cables you get with your phones. There is also the fact that um, this is also data transfer. Some cables are charge only. They do charge a lot quicker than the charge and data ports, but um, this is also data. So let's uh, see if it works. Uh, I have an iPad Pro here. Uh, oops, an iPad Pro. Let's, uh, of course, because it's an iPad Pro, I need the adapter. USB-C and and there you go we are charging I've got notifications uh, yeah so it just as a to show you that it does charge um, it is a very good little ingenious um, thing it will go as part of my EDC it is something that I recommend um, you have if you don't have a lightning cable if you don't need uh, sorry if you don't have a, a lightning product you don't have a USB-C product there are other combinations of this cable that the um, they do do uh, there's a micro USB um, you can get a USB-C cable with a USB uh, micro adapter uh, there's various sort of combinations to do uh, as part of my Kickstarter campaign. I bought this. It cost me nine dollars. Uh, sorry, eleven dollars, which works out to be nine pounds roughly. Uh, shipping was a bit more on top of that. Um, I did get a couple of add-ons with it as well, which we won't go to in this video. I'll do a separate video on that uh, for some of Lever Gear's other uh, items. Uh, we do have a EDC cooperative. Uh, discount code so you can get 10% off products on their website um, I'm not 100% certain but I do not think these are on the website at the moment because they're still going through the Kickstarter fulfillment but as obviously as soon as they are uh, you'll be able to get them off the website so there you go that's about it uh, quick and dirty sort of EDC related video on an EDC product uh, that I genuinely like uh, thanks for watching if you like what you're seeing give us a thumbs up um subscribe to us on here uh, find us on facebook instagram and um, twitter our website all the links will be down below uh, thanks again for watching take care see you on the next one